New York City. We're with Albert and Nick from The Strokes. Play a little pool. Emerge victorious. Yes, Beer 30. There's a new <laughs> album on the shelf, August the, October the 20th. And I should say for the record, that's it's superb. So, thank cheers, fellas. Saying. Well done. Thank you, sir. Congratulations. You guys yes. have come back with a great record. Well, thank you very much. Nice one. It's called Room on Fire. We're going to talk about it. You guys ready to have a little chin, chat chin. about it? Congratulations. Yes, yeah. cheers, cheers. I know that the name is from a, it's a lyric in, in one of the songs. Was it the only title that you guys threw around when it came time to name the new kid? Or did you have a whole bunch of them that were floating around? There was a couple, yeah. but I don't think we're really at liberty. <laughs> no one ever does. No one ever does. You're always like, do you want to tell us? Like, <coughs> no, not really. Yeah. I think we'll stick with it. There's the reason fun. why they didn't, they didn't make the cut. <laughs> when yeah, you man. came off the sort of Is This It tour, and I think you sort of rounded it up at the end, it's sort of about the end of summer last year, wasn't it? After you'd done Reading and Leeds. You we did one last American tour after that, just uh -huh. to kind of end it. Was it a good note nice. that you ended on? Did you feel yeah. tired? Note. Yeah, right. But it was great. The tour, the last tour, was great though. Yeah, yeah. The whole thing was probably, great. Our, probably our best tour was that one. Mm -hmm. It's just after two years, of that stuff it was nice to be home finally. And yeah. We took. I think we finished in November of last. What night of last year? That was. Yeah, 2002. Yeah, well, 2002. Yeah. Yeah, it's quite a quick turnaround for this record, considering. I think. Yes. I don't know. It seemed like as soon as we got off the road, we took a couple of weeks off, and then we just started working on these new songs. Yeah. So it was about three months of just rehearsing stuff, and then we went to the studio. Did you adjust to that kind of couple of weeks off? Were you suffering from sort of tour routine fatigue? Do you know what I mean? A little bit of both. I mean, it was great to be off, to know that not just being off, off like for like a while till the mm -hmm. next record. Mm -hmm. But it was also sometimes like, what the hell am I doing? <laughs> Too much time on my hands. Yeah, yeah had, that's true. You had a couple of couple of, of, of new tracks that you felt you were ready to start work on with the record, right? I mean, I believe it was like Zinui, I think is one that was being thrown around. Right. And there was Meet Me in the Bathroom, was right. the other one. I mean, I've heard that you guys aren't particularly big fans of riding on the road, so were these just like nice... Well, it's not a big fan, and it's so hard to do it. It's, mm. such, it's, almost, it's almost impossible for us. We kind of need to be stuck in the studio, cause it, and like, you know, spend, little, spend hours on it, and not just like the yeah. five minutes sound yeah. check. Yeah. There's not a lot of time on the road, yeah. is what it is. Like, when do you really get to work on new stuff? It's, yeah. Like pretty much when you're sound checking is yeah. when we would do it and we don't have it's just not enough time there yeah plus there's everyone so, there and it's like <laughs> yeah, all those songs that we were the, the new songs that we were playing um on the last tour there i think they were written for the most part during little one two week breaks back in new york yeah. and then we'd work on them and go back out on the road and play them but for the record we we, we kind of tweak them not for the record but for the actual <laughs> for album. the record <laughs> for the record we kind of <laughs> tweak those songs for the record how excited were you at the prospect of going back in the studio, going back into TMF or wherever you were going to go and record this record? I mean, were you guys really like, sooner rather than later, we need to we need to capitalize on this momentum? Yeah, well, I don't think capitalize on the momentum, but just, I think as a band, we kind of really wanted to go you know, lock ourselves up in the studio again. So it's a lot of fun to kind of close the door and just be in a room with everyone working. How'd you feel about the songs on Is This It? Because I think... They've been played so many times on the radio, and you'd released quite a few singles off that album by the time that you guys had finished touring. And it was just so embedded, and people who like that kind of music and, and, and read those kind of magazines and go to your shows and stuff, they'd live with that record for a long time. I mean, was it getting difficult for you guys to, to play those songs at, by the end of November, you know? Not difficult. I mean, if anything, it was easier, but sometimes... Difficult emotionally. Doing, doing the same thing night after night. Yeah. Because kind of we didn't have the didn't have the largest repertoire <laughs> so it was just a, every night a question of like switching the set list around <laughs> got pretty boring yeah but now we're fortunate enough to hold a batch new songs in there so we get to pick and choose the stuff from the last record make things but both records are pretty cool. short man i mean you just have to play both <laughs> records you want to play an hour long show no, unless you're going to go no. for jazz odysseys <laughs> no. no we probably won't do no, that the brixton show which had like 13 or 14 songs was like 55 minutes mm -hmm. Yeah, that's really just perfect, I think. Just, yeah, an just hour, under an mean? hour, just over an hour. That's, yeah. really, that's just about right for a concert, I think. When was the last time you listened to Is This It? When was the last time that you actually like, individually sat down and had a listen to that record? <laughs> when we were in Japan. Yeah, when we were rehearsing, <laughs> rehearsing to go to Japan. Had you forgotten? Uh, not so much forgotten, no, it's but just, it's just nice to, uh, nice to sort of refresh your yeah. sometimes. How was that Japan tour? Was it fun? Well, like the gigs, a couple of gigs. Yeah, two gigs. Yeah, yeah right. Shows. Yeah. It was extensive, crazy. Extensive Asian tour of Asia. Was it good? Good to be back out playing live? Oh, uh, yeah. It was amazing, actually. I mean, to not play for six months and then go out in front of 40,000 people yeah. in a baseball stadium. And play, That's pretty and much what you left off. Reading, straight from Reading, you know, after Japan, 40,000 people. Actually, funny enough is I felt 
I felt nervous before I got out there, and then when, when I finally got out there, I felt I felt really comfortable. It was Japan's a lovely country, and the yeah. Japanese youth is just mm. they're, they're a good crowd. They're very nice to the strokes. Very respectful as well as people. Um, yeah, you know, comparatively. Compared to the Brits, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> you know this is going out to Britain, right? <laughs> yeah, no, I, I don't know. <laughs> um, he, means, he means you guys no harm. <laughs> Let me throw a couple of song titles your way, see how you feel about it now that you've, you know, you, you've played those songs again a couple of times in Japan, but really you've had some time away from this, this it. I mean, hard to explain. What's your initial feeling about a song like that? Will you, will you want to play that again? Is it one that you still feel? Yeah. That's yeah. one of my favorite songs in the yeah. record. Likewise. Uh, yeah. yeah. I just think every time... And even watching the video to that, like, I can just mix. I, I love that song. Mm. New York yeah, City Cops. Yeah. I like that song a lot. <laughs> I mean, there's sort of the obvious ones like Last Night, which is a great song. I still love that song, but then, you know, every time I start that bang, 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 I'm thinking, yeah. oh boy, here we go again.